What's up guys? This week's video is going to be a July favorites video and I am like so excited for this video because I love, I don't know, I just love favorites videos. So I will be doing these every month. If you don't know what a favorites video is, basically it's just me telling you guys everything that I like really loved or enjoyed or discovered, anything like that that I found in the month of May. I mean, whoa, this is July. Anything like that that I have found in the month of July. Um, so I'm just going to be sharing that stuff with you guys. And let's just get right into it. The first things I'm going to be starting off with are my beauty favorites. I'm going to be showing you guys my Lush products. I'm not going to go into detail about these. But I am just showing you that this Super Balm Scalp Treatment and this Mint Juleps Lip Scrub have been my favorite this month. And if you want to know more about these products, then you can click my Lush Haul and Review which will be right here. The second beauty favorite is this Smashbox uh, Foundation Primer. And honestly, I've never used a primer until um, about this month. And I bought this at Sephora. And it's just Smashbox. And it's just a clear little gel. And you put it all over your face. And I just find that it really, really helped my skin a lot. Like, it made my makeup look a lot less oily. It just, I don't know. And it just helps it stay on all day. And I really like this. So, go get it. Next thing is this Jergens Natural Go Bleh, Glow 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 It's Glow. This Jergens Natural Glow um, Moisturizer. Basically, it has SPF 20 and it just tans your skin gradually. Like you put it on every night. Like my skin is always really white on my face and the rest of my body is tan. So I put this on every night and it helps tan. And I find that it just really, really moisturizes my face, like, really good. And it just comes in this little thing. And it's pretty thick, so you don't need to use a lot every time you use it. It spreads really well. And I keep turning it around. But I really, really love this product. And you can get it at, like, CVS or Target or anywhere like that. The next two products are hair care products. And this one is the Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Texturizing Sea Salt Spray. I've been using this for a few months. I have been using it, I don't know, I've been using it for a long time, but during the summer I've really been using it a lot because it just gives me beachy looking hair. And then they also sell this at Urban Outfitters, and this is the Be Batiste, Batiste? I don't know what that says. But basically it's just dry shampoo, and this is in the color Light. It's like light blonde. So it's for my hair and basically what you do, you just, you just, there you go. And it <coughs> smells great. <gasps> okay. So that is this dry shampoo, but I really, really have been loving this a lot because also, again, like I said, in the summer, if your hair is just looking like a little greasy, this just really, really helps, especially if you have blonde hair with root looking stuff like I do this works really well I'm like choking on this though like it's really strong the last beauty product I'm gonna share with you guys is this skin to mint moisturizing hydrating shaving gel and honestly this is like the best shaving gel I've ever used I bought this because I went to camp and it came in like a little mini size and I've been so obsessed with it I forgot how much I loved shaving gel and this is raspberry rain so it smells like heaven and berries and cute boys and it just smells great so I definitely recommend this the next thing I'm gonna be sharing with you guys are my music favorites for this month and I have a few so I'm gonna go through them pretty quickly the first band that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys is Chase Atlantic and they came out with this EP called Deliance or whatever it's called I don't really know how to say it but I've been loving it a lot and they have like six songs on there and it's just really awesome and I listen to them in the shower all the time. The next one would be Paramore. Their album came out a while ago but I've been listening to it a lot lately and I'm going to their concert on Friday so I'm so excited. If you guys don't know I'm a really big Paramore fan and I just love Paramore. Um, the next band and then I'm done with bands is obviously Five Seconds of Summer. Their album is like the most amazing thing. I listen to it in the shower, when I'm tanning, in the car, when I'm getting ready. I listen to it for everything. Like, honestly, I love this album so much. It's like, it's just like everything that I need in life, like in this album. It's what it is, basically. 
The next few songs are just singles, and the first one would be Happy Little Pill by Troy Sivan. He is a YouTuber, I believe, and this song is awesome. It's kind of like a weird, like, vibe. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's really cool, and I like that song. The next one would be Break Free by Ariana Grande, and it features Zed, and I really, really love this song, and I'm super excited for her new album to come out, so when it does, I'll definitely be probably be... Blah, blah, blah. I will definitely probably be talking about that. And then the next two songs are really not like me to like that much, but I really have been listening to them a lot. I really love Shower by Becky G. I think that's the name of it. Yeah, I really love Shower by Becky G. And I really love Birthday by Katy Perry. They're so fun to listen to and like dance and just sing really loud too. So, yeah. I'm going to be sharing every month with you a book that I've read. And this book looks so beaten up and like disgusting like the whole everything about this book is like hideous like look at it it's like falling i don't know but this was honestly probably one of my favorite books my friend suggested it to me and it's awesome it's called callum and harper and if you want to know more about it you can just go look it up or get the goodreads app um but it's awesome and it just got me in my feelings i just i can't i'm not even gonna tell you what it's about because you just need to go get this book or order it on amazon that's what i did and just that's what you need to do now to the random favorites my random favorites can go anywhere from like a pencil to food so basically i'm just going to be sharing with you guys a bunch of random crap that i loved this Rainforest Sugar Cane Candle from Bath and Body Works. You guys know I love candles. Like, that is what I spend majority of my money on other than, like, Brandy Melville. But this candle smells so good. And I went in Bath and Body Works to get one of those little air fresheners. And I saw this and I just, I just fell in love, guys. Okay, guys, y'all cannot judge me for this, like, what? <laughs> you all know you wanted to try it. It is the Kim Kardashian Hollow game. Look at my girl. She's literally so cute. I love her. And I'm obsessed with this game. I play it all the time. I'm like really crazy about this game. So I really like this. And if you don't like Kim Kardashian, I'm sorry. You're just missing out on a whole life you could have with her in this game. Next two things I can't actually show you, but you need to go watch them. Like, are you listening to what I'm saying? Like, you need to go watch them. The first thing is New Girl. It's amazing. It's this TV series. I don't know if it shows on TV. probably does, but it's on Netflix, and I found it. And it has Zoe Deschanel, and I love Zoe Deschanel. She's so cute, and if you don't know who that is, look it up because she's perfect. I'm just really obsessed with it, and the episodes are 21 minutes. Like, it's not long at all, um, but I really, really love it, so go check it out on Netflix because it's awesome. Okay. The next thing I'm going to talk about is the most, like, this has just had, like, such an effect on my life. Like, I just, it's like a reality show, but it's on YouTube, guys. Like, you probably know what I'm talking about by now, and if you don't, you need to go check it out. It's called Summer Break, and it's on YouTube. It's just a reality TV show about these group of teenagers. I watched the first episode, guys. I got so hooked. Like... Guys, I'm obsessed with the show. I watched the whole series in a day, and obviously they're like not that long. It's on YouTube, um, but please just watch a few episodes. Like even if you don't like the first one, just at least like watch the second one or the third one. It's amazing. I love it. I'm obsessed with it, and I watch it every week. And it's just so cute. Oh my gosh, guys, please go watch it. I'm obsessed. It's like honestly, I could go watch the episodes again. The last two things are actually a food, or not really food, I guess, drinks. But it is this vanilla latte Starbucks drink. So basically, I'll show you the little container. Basically, it comes in this big jug, and you can get it at Target or HEB or wherever. And it's just basically a vanilla latte flavored from Starbucks, you know. And I just put ice in my little mug or cup, whatever you want. And you just pour this in there, and it's like you're having your own iced coffee from Starbucks. And it's my favorite, and I love it, guys. And go get it. If you don't like Starbucks, then get a life. The last thing is this little berry fruit smoothie mix. You can get them at Target, obviously. It has a little Target logo. But I'm obsessed with this, guys. I love smoothies. And this is dripping, like, the water. Ew. Basically, you can go to Target, and I'm sure they have them at H-E-B, too. 
but there these just mix and it has frozen fruit in it because I love smoothies but I don't like cutting up the fruit and I don't like doing all this stuff and I feel like it's just too complicated for me it's probably not that complicated I'm just like really lazy so I just pour that in the blender I pour the mix in you put like a cup of milk in there and you just blend it up and it's like the most amazing smoothie you've ever had it's like jamba juice in your house that is all for my July favorites video. I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope that you give it a thumbs up if you really did like it and comment some of your favorite things that you really liked in the month of July. Again, I will be doing these every single month so stay tuned for those and I also make videos every Friday. Thank you again guys for watching and stay tuned for next week.